Hi! In this video, I'll show you how to install Point Cloud Library in a Linux machine and also show you how to use it for the first time. To make things simple, we'll just follow the steps as given in PCL website. Let's get started. Make sure that you are uh, signing as a root. Then the second step is to uh, go to this uh, website under Downloads, click on Linux. And for information, I'm using Ubuntu 14.04 uh, running in this machine. All right, so then just copy this line of code. Now this will install pre-built binaries for Linux. Let's do the same thing. The second line of code. Control C, Control C to V. Finally, this last step. So your um, PCI library is successfully installed. Now the second thing that I'm going to show you is how to use it for the first time. So let me exit from root and make a directory where I And then inside this uh, directory, create a directory with the name build. Okay, and we need to create two files. Let's go to the documentation now, and we'll just uh, directly use the example that's given in the tutorial. Scroll down. And under this uh, heading, using PCL in your own project, click on that. And we're going to use a example uh, code that is shown here. All right. I'm using a uh, Vim text editor. Make sure that name of the file is exactly as given here. Okay. And we can just copy this line of code. We also need to create another file. So if you scroll down, so under compiling and running the program, make sure that the file name is exactly as given here. Let's copy it again. Paste it. Alright, now we have two files created. Now let's uh, get inside the build directory. So the next step is to run cmake a command. If you haven't installed cmake before, the program will prompt you to install it. I'll make sure that you follow the steps. I have already installed it in my computer. So I can directly run cmake dot dot and it will nicely uh, link all these uh, files for me. So this is successful. And this is, uh, these are the folders that, or the files that you'll see created. And next uh, step is to run a make command, which will build uh, the program for us. All right, so once the build is uh, com completed, um, these are the files that you will be able to see. So you see the one highlighted um, on green here is the file that was created. Now, if you want to run it, just uh, dot slash, cd, right? Okay, 
So these are the uh, output of the file or the code that we uh, copied. All right, so now you are ready to uh, follow other example code that are given in the documentation. All right, thank you.